Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, please subscribe. I'd really love that. If you're returning, how you doing? What we're going to be talking about today is what are you paying for gas where you live? California gas prices have soared to the highest point of this year on Tuesday, and that is according to AAA. The average price per gallon for regular unleaded in California has surged to 526. The national average is 385 a gallon. And it's only getting worse, especially with all of these disasters that are happening. Gas prices in California have surged to the highest point of the year and are approaching prices seen last summer. <clears throat> According to AAA, the average price of gallon of regular unleaded in California was 526. It's up 10 cents over the past week and 37 cents since last month. A year ago, drivers were paying 534 a gallon. In LA County alone, the average price for regular unleaded gas was 536. The national average, like I said, 385. You know, it's pretty sad when the first order of business for 46 was to kill tens of thousands of jobs, especially when he signed the executive order canceling the Keystone Pipeline. I don't even think, think he realizes how it's all coming back to bite him in the keister. So gas prices have spiked since he was installed. Gas prices were around 234 when 45 left office. Now, the national average is 385. But if you live in Florida, gas prices here jumped steeply on Monday. In Southeast Florida, putting the price well above the national average. On Monday, a Shell station in Palm Beach Gardens, Florida, had a price of a gallon of gas at nearly $7. The gas station priced a gallon of premium gas at 6 49 which is well above the local average of 469 even unleaded gas was more than a dollar higher at 499 the national uh, average now gas stations they set their own prices so it's not uncommon to see some stations that are above the state average it just depends on where you're located sometimes you see stations with higher prices like that are near airports, for example. But $7 a gallon? Talk about taking advantage of the storms that are approaching us from the Atlantic Ocean. It's called price gouging. It's illegal. All right, guys, I'm out of here. I'll see you in the next one, okay? You stay safe, you stay positive, you keep prepping. And as always, fear less and stock up on some gas. Ciao.